This looks good. I can build it. Oh, frick. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Weasel, and we are playing Paco's Ship Sinking Simulator Sandbox game. Yeah, that sounds complicated, but it's pretty simple and pretty much uh, pretty fun. So, it is a sinking simulator. Paco always wanted us to sink objects in a program, uh, and there were none. So, he built his own one, which is great. I always want a program where I can blow up things without any reason. Just, just blow up things. Uh, I cannot do it, so uh, I am stuck without a explosion simulator, but this is a sinking simulator, which is also pretty awesome. Um, he wrote the engine himself. Um, he's now on Indiegogo, and I stumbled upon it on Steam Greenlight. So, if you like the idea, vote for it. It is actually really fun, so um, you gotta try it out um, for yourself, and there will be more features, which will, I guess, make the game definitely more interesting. Now it's really basic, so um, I'm really looking forward to what he has planned, so definitely check out his Indiegogo campaign, and um, anything I missed? Well, you can draw your own ship, um, but before I show you my own personal ship I drew, um, let's sink this one. Um, sinking is pretty easy. You have two tools. You have grab, which will lift up a ship or put it down and whatnot. Um, but we don't need that right now. I just want it to float. And now let's see how the sinking simulation actually works. So I will break the hull here. Yeah. So now water is flowing inside the boat, which will make it sing. Pretty realistic, by the way. I mean, it looks pretty realistic to me. Um, I have no idea about sinking ships, but I imagine it will probably look something like this if there's all of a sudden a hole in here. So water is flowing in, represented by the blue stuff. The springs are now getting blue. Um, and bye-bye, now it's sinking. Sinking down to the ground. Down to the ground. Yeah. Down. Oh, it's, it's actually making a... a Salto? No, no, now it's sinking directly down. So, and it will smash on the bottom of the ocean. Um, yeah, let, let's see that, because that also looks pretty fun. So, impact in three, two, one. I have to make the sounds myself. There are no sounds yet in this game. So, um, yeah, it crumbles down to the ground. Bit over dramatic, I think, for hitting the floor, but that's okay, that's okay. I, I still have no idea how that works. Anyway, so let's load up other ships. So there are all these ships supplied with this game, like this little, I think it's a steamer. No, it's not a steamer, it's a, it's a cruise ship. Let's call it a small cruise ship or something like this. Or it's a ferry, I don't know. So there are these um, brown, these brown things will actually stop the ship from, um, will stop the water. So. Um, how could I show that? Yes, if I let's let's smash the hall, all of this here. It will wait. No, this did not work. I gotta show it with the t Titanic. So this one is actually sinking pretty fast. Um, I'm not sure what the, what the, what the black black springs do. Maybe they're more stable or something. I don't know. So you can actually rip the whole ship apart and do all awesome, all sorts of awesome things. Um, you can have two ships at the same time. It's also no problem whatsoever. So I don't know if they have other um, characteristics because this one has a black hull, this has a brown hull. Anyway, he wants to add uh, more things in the future like Dom Lemini. Yeah, um, golds. He wants to add golds to the sandbox. Uh, motors, engines, pumps, crew, and so forth. So. Um, this is really, really basic, and he really wants to um, continue with this game. Oh, this is a pretty nice example. See, there is this. Oh, that's why he put a hole into the ship. So the black ones are actually sealing off, um, just like a hull, the rest of the ship to, well, yeah, being flooded. So though that water flew, flowed in, I don't know why, there, why there's water here. There shouldn't be any water. I mean... I don't know. Um, anyway, so this is now full of water and the ship is still not sinking because, well, there's no hole anywhere else and the water is not flowing there, but uh, let's be evil. Now I think, oh no, it's not deep enough. I think this might do the trick. Will this do the trick? Yeah, now, yeah, see, now it's flowing down here and filling up 
the rest of the ship. Let's be a little bit more brutal. Yeah, that's better. Much better. Much, 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 much better. Yeah, now it's flowing in fa even faster. Yeah. Yeah, that's fine. That's working just fine. Okay, let's let, let's make that sink faster. Maybe maybe a goal will be to sink a fa ship as fast as possible, like this. I think that should do the trick pretty well. Yep, that works fine. So if a ship has no bottom, it will sink extremely fast. The more you know. So now let's go to my ship. Well, first let's load up the Titanic. He supplied you with a Titanic. Yep, you can sink the Titanic. Let's play Iceberg. Ah, Captain the Iceberg. Bye-bye. <laughs> now it will sink. And the awesome thing is it will also break. Just like the real thing, right? Awesome. Anyway. <laughs> I don't know why a sinking ship amuses me that much. But I like to see things break. Probably it's some man thing. So I made my own one. I made a Titanic 2. Which is insanely huge. Um, it's really easy to do it. You just open up any graphics tool and um, uh, let me let me quickly show you. So uh, I made this one in Photoshop, and you basically can paint whatever you want. Um, you just take a brush. You can also use, uh, I guess, you can use the paint, at least the one on Windows Seven, because it has to be a PNG. And wherever you paint, it will well do things. So you can actually build your own ship, which is amazing um, so let's 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 add something to it uh, I'll grab this and quickly 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 well what to do what to oh no no let's 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 add it let add a small little ship right next to it oh god this is now taking longer than I expected come here I didn't want to show you how to how I made a ship but why not if I'm at it right let's let's quickly show you how to make a ship so I now paint a little boat like this. Oh, this is a beautiful little boat. Um, and it, it still needs a hull. I think the small ones also need hulls. So, yeah. Isn't that a nice little boat? Yeah, it is. Where's our little ship? Where's our little shippy ship? Come here. Wait. Come here. There it is. There it is. Oh, it's beautiful, isn't it? It's beautiful. It's a beauty. It's a beautiful and so small. So, this is a friggin' huge ship. It's, it's, it's ginormous gigantuous so you can pretty much build your own ship uh, no matter how ridiculous um, I might actually play around with it a little bit more so let's add a little call to there and as you can see it's filling up with water just like I wanted to let's add this and this it's a little bit faster now, it will not flow over there because of these um, separators but once the water gets above them it will float over the separator and the whole ship is screwed. Oh, actually, it broke already. Oh, my God. Building such a huge ship is not a good idea. Not a good idea at all. So, maybe, actually. <laughs> okay, this one is pretty much screwed. But maybe. Oh, no, no, it's breaking. It's breaking. What a damn shame. I thought the separator might do the trick. But, nope. Still breaking. Still breaking. This ship is screwed. Good. Anyway, if you enjoyed this video, please give it a like. If you enjoyed the game, uh, go on there uh, on his Steam Greenlight page or his Indiegogo page. Have a look, uh, support him, and this is a really cool idea. I mean, that's what Indie is all about. Do your own thing, no matter how stupid people may think it is. I really like the game uh, or the simulation, and yeah, that's the Titanic 2. Went just as well as the first one, didn't it? Yep, 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 yep. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. I'm Weasel. I'm out. And I hope to see you around. Bye.